as you can tell by my time, it was a little hectic getting everything ready. Ready? Yep. Okay. This handy dandy stand is just not so handy dandy. Right. I have to watch for this button. Let's do that. Got it. You want to put a light on? This light? Um, hey guys. Ooh, look at that, y'all. Okay. So we're making pot pies. Okay. Hey. Um, God, you guys were hella busy on the little stream. I was just trying to catch up on everybody's stories. Um, so every grab your phone so you can read it. Um, okay, baby, what we doing? Pot so, pie, pot pie. chicken pot pie. This is the last comfort food we're doing. Okay, guys. Today is the last comfort food we're doing. Gosh, you guys. Somebody tell me I look awful. Um, today is the last comfort food because we somehow forgot that this Sunday is Super Bowl. And so we need to do some because appetizers are our thing. We love appetizers. So we're going to probably do like Joe's version of, um, what is that thing called? Um... Um, uh, yeah. Southwestern egg rolls? So, yeah, no, no, no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No? Yeah. Yeah. The one that has avocado ranch. Avocado ranch. Southwestern yeah. egg rolls. Yeah, Southwestern egg rolls. They're from TGI Fridays, I believe, or something like that. Okay, let's start doing this. Pot. Um, what... A quick version of this is get a can of cream of chicken soup and then... Throw in your vegetables, your chicken, and then your carrots and your potatoes and everything. But I saw a recipe and I said, gosh, that is so simple. I'm doing it. So I'm trying it with you guys because I want to know how to do it. Okay, so here we go, y'all. Well, I mean, it's kind of like you're making your own soup. And you're going to put oil. I put about a tablespoon, two tablespoons, celery, onion. I used... A quarter cup onion and one full stalk of celery. Only because I don't like celery that much, y'all. If y'all like celery, do it up. I just don't care for celery that much. And garlic. In the jar? I'll get it. This one? Yeah. That's one here? Yeah. Give me a spoon, baby, please. How was your guys' weekend? I hope it was super good. I am so sorry about yesterday's. You just like celery as well. I mean, I kind of do it big. Thank you. Um, so that way Joe can still have it. But I just, like I put it in my, like I put it in the caldo. I put it in um, chicken soup and stuff. But Joe likes it. Um, I put about that much garlic oh. for now. Because girl, we know we doing the garlic later. All good, Bale. Um... I cook on medium to high to high heat. Um, what was I telling you guys? About the different recipes. If you guys want a recipe that you guys are kind of saying, hey, oh, Chasey came on. <laughs> Chasey. I don't know what made him check mean it. Felipe? Felipe, como esta, Felipe? <laughs> <laughs> uh, we had such a good weekend with our niece and nephew, you guys. Um, just... They're such a blessing. I, I'm really... Empty Nesters works for, like, a lot of people. It just made me, with the loss in my um, home, it made me really sad having the... Um, I'm trying to zoom in, but it's like... What do you mean? I, I, it's there, but there I just... Go. Yeah, but see, it's at an angle. Yeah. I okay, got to do the one can, around can, my neck, the way they said. Hold on. Hey, 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 there you go. Get it closer. There you um, go. Oh, look at you. So, it. I'm blessed that my brother shares his niece, his kids, and my niece and nephew because my son and my daughter are not present with me. My daughter is out of the country. Um, so, I'm, I mean, I'm grateful. We had a super, super blast this weekend. We were, we did, we went on walks. We took the dogs for walks. We played Mexican bingo. Um, we just did things at aunts and uncles. Oh, we took them shopping with uh, Friday. We bought a bunch of snacks, like 12 packs of pops and so different. You got to put either high. Hey, Jilly Bean. Hey, Jilly, Jilly girl. I got to put my ring on. Hey, Jilly girl. Um, I am 
trying to get Dizzle, because she's got a shirt business, to print me um, yeah, garlic's an awesome. apron. Yeah, it smells like a lot of garlic in here right now. Woo woo! Oh, can you... Yep, I'm nosy. Yep, I'm nosy? What is it, nosy? Okay. Y'all, I didn't even send just a group text. Anybody in my little group? Y'all are going to just stop putting me in that group. I know it. Okay, so once your celery, and you can smell it, but it's just kind of, it's garlic, celery, and onion. Just brewing away in there. Okay, get up now. Right. Back up in there. No, evening vibes. Chasey said evening vibes. Come here. <laughs> Come on. Inside joke. We had a lot Come of on. fun. Get up in there. Okay, so I am going to, actually I might put a little more oil. I'm going to show you guys what. The reason I'm putting a little more oil is because I am going to put some flour in there. That's what it looks like. Okay. I'm going to put, you want enough so that it's, the pan's wet. That's a good way to put it. You want the pan wet. A tablespoon of flour. And I'm probably going to put two tablespoons of flour. And it's kind of, I don't want to say it's sad, but chicken pot pie used to be the kids' favorite and everything. So we'd make like two pies of it. I was thinking about that today. I'd make two pies um, for the pot pies. And this time I'm making just a small square pan of the pot pie. Oh, is my dump cake somewhere? Did we take everything out of it? Uh, I didn't even think about the pan because... Did I eat all of it? Shut up. The second one too? I think so. Okay. Did we? You think it's in the oven? Any comments? Uh -huh. Want me to look? Yeah. <laughs> 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 to see if it's in there? <laughs> I doubt it. No, where did no, it go? Well, we ate it all. We ate the second batch too? Yes, oh, yeah, crumble, Chase. With the crumble. We were Chase Sam. Oh, you're right. That night, The next day on Sunday, we came home and ate it. Chase you're had right. a little bit. Yeah, you're right. Uh, cheery fan. Uh, do you want to grab that broth? So I just grabbed chicken. I got, I got a couple of uh, dark meat legs and thighs. I boiled it on the pan. And then I just shredded it. I kept the broth. How much you want in there? I can, I can use a, a, a ladle okay. if you want. Okay, there you go. Here's the broth. I'll show them. Lower down. There's the broth that the chicken cooked in. And you can, I to put celery in it and onion, but that was just to give it flavor. You can, if you're making Mexican rice, if you're making chicken, Here, I'll make chicken soup with you guys, dumplings. So here's my broth. Instead of buying broth, there you go. Instead of buying broth, here's my pan, y'all. It's just got flour on the vegetables, okay? And I am using chicken broth instead of water. Um, I'll probably put a little bit of water, um, a little bit of heavy cream in it and not just put broth because I do want it to be a cream of chicken soup. And I, I my mom used to make it with peas and I leg, literally hated it. I didn't even want to eat it because I don't like peas. So I omitted altogether and I put just carrots. I put potatoes in it. Now, uh, you know what you could do, baby? Start a pan so I could put those in there. You want what? The puppas. Yep, just so I can put those in there. Just a small one. I'm going to put some of them, not all of them. Oh, oh, baby, I'm sorry. Heavy whipping cream. So I put, total I would put, I would say one and a half cups of chicken broth. And then I'm going to put, woo, see, I knew it was going to happen. That's why I put it on. My heavy whipping cream. Um, I don't really measure, but one quarter cup of heavy whipping cream. It's hermit, Chase. Hermit. Hermit. With an H. <laughs> you guys. Is it big enough? Yeah, I just got to do the bumpers. All right. I'll That's put okay. them in there. And not all of them. You can just put some like, with your hand. You can just... Oh. All right. Just throw them, and then you can put some water, the hot water, so it'll be quicker.
I'm going to show you guys our chicken. It's salt and pepper. Remember, guys, salt and pepper are your best friends when you're cooking. Pepper is going to change for you, hon. your flavor. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then go to the hot water from the dish. It's okay. Hot water from what? The dispenser, so it's already half boiling. Oh, oh, boiling. Okay. Uh, salt enhances your food. Pepper changes your food. Changes your food. Anybody know that? All right, I'm gonna bring you guys uh, over for a look at. Eh? Put you lower. Is this good, baby. What's that? Is that good? Too much? Um, look, go ahead and put it in. I'll put some beet, um, the uh, right. potatoes. Okay. That water right there. All right. And then I have diced potatoes that small. If you do a potato, Joe did it beforehand so that way we didn't have to worry about it. Here's your potato like this. Cut it in half. And then cut them like you're doing long slices of potatoes. Like you're making french fries. Like you're making french fries. And then you lay it down just so that they're... Oh, shit. <laughs> this right here. Oh, shoot. Um, they're about the same size. So that's what we're doing. I'm doing them so there are, like, you can stick a fork through them. Not com completely done because they can get cooked in here. But I wanted to show you guys what our soup is. Can you soup a little like. bit more? Yes, please. And then you can put one ladle in here. One ladle in there. There you go. Okay, good. Can you see both pans? Yeah, I, wanna, okay. I want them to see the soup. Ooh. Right now, you've got your cream of chicken soup with garlic, onion, and celery. Homemade cream Homemade of chicken. Homemade cream of chicken soup. You didn't stop at the store and pick up a can because a lot of times you stop there to get all the items you need to make something and you usually forget one because that happens to me <laughs> all the time. I'm going to grab my chicken. I mean, you could literally just make a chicken soup for lunch. I mean, Joe eats... I don't eat tomato soup, but I make homemade tomato soup for Joe. I roast the tomatoes in the oven. Honey, yeah. We're not going into other ones. <laughs> I make homemade to. tomato soup. <laughs> make sure you guys get your the sides of the the sides that have cooked on the side of your your pan um when you add your when you add your water it's going to thicken then you add your milk and it's going to thicken and every time you add another you add it back in i personally would grab the a spatula and take all of the cooked oh, baby. cooked um the cooked well, let me just show you see it just kind of gets cooked on the side i didn't want to say that cooked soup but it gets kind of um on the side i don't even know what to call that but it gets kind of just builds up on the side of the pan and then you want to get your potatoes to about like i said four tender this just happened you guys witnessed it i leaned my hand on that um Uh, no, it's just, so the only thing I have left to put is we bought these because we were making egg rolls and then we didn't even make the egg rolls and it was pretty sad for me because I was pretty excited. So we instead have carrot, carrot matchsticks or something like that. Matchstick carrots. Hmm. I mean, I think we usually buy a whole carrot. And then we do it ourselves <laughs> and we cut them like into bite sizes. Um, can you guys see that? It looks really pretty. Mm -hmm. Put the fire lower. Where's your, where's your burn? Where's your burn, honey? Right there. Right there. There's so much hazel in there. Why does witch hazel take it off? Yeah, it'll make it feel a little better. Okay. Oh, sorry about that. No, I'm just kidding. Okay. Here's our soup. And the only thing we have left to put in it, you guys, is our potatoes. That look good. <laughs> you want to try, baby? Yeah. 
Tell me if it needs more salt. I, did, I didn't put as many shakes as I want to put. Mm -hmm. Only because... I don't know why. I just did. Let me answer the questions. Mm. Mm. Salt. Uh, I have no mods at all. A little salt, baby. Yeah? Yep. Alrighty. I need to get a mod in there. Hey, guys. Hey, Flo. Hey, everybody. We're doing stuff. <laughs> We're doing We're stuff. We're doing stuff. Hi, Gabby. Oh, my God. I'm so glad I got my, <laughs> like, some guy, some people that come back in. That, that makes me feel really, 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 really cool and special that some people that cooked with me before, um, like, come back to cook. Okay, so salt. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Salt, salt, salt. salt. How's the flavor, though? Flavor's great. My, this is, the broth it helps you start it up. It, you boiled everything. Some people put this in it i don't because i've got the chicken broth this is basically chicken broth but it's dried so you put this in a glass of hot water if i didn't boil chicken i would grab this and i put it in hot water and then i would um i like let it dissolve because it breaks up and then i'd pour that chicken broth or whatever into here so this is the same thing as this is chicken broth this is dried chicken broth that you make with water when you get home or you boil chicken you take your chicken out and then you debone it so the, I mean, if you don't have chicken then grab some broth I usually pick up beef, beef and chicken broth or the dry powder ones no no you're okay so anyways, that's what I do because um, if I'm planning to use it for something, I forgot to take this out beforehand. Did I put salt? Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, the, that square pan. Square pan. The square pan for the cake. Oh, the, yeah, yeah. Hey, you need to realize you're like all scattered, <laughs> like you're nervous. Don't be nervous. This is, this is literally we, going here, my life. I, we don't need to rush. We're just having fun in the kitchen with the, the peoples. Alright. Having fun. Having fun. <laughs> I'm gonna punch you, baby. You Alright, hold up. Okay. There you go. No, I need it for the pot. The, the one we had. Oh, the cookie sheet? No, baby. What are you looking for, baby? How do you make a pot pie? Oh. Okay, so where we had our, this, the glass one that we, if you have a round one, that's fine. There's a round one right on the left side. The round pan, oh. cook cake pan. But I was this looking one? for my, no. Uh, I'm looking, you just go right there. Right there is the round right one. Here. But I had a glass one that All I've right. made the dump cake in. I'll, I'll look for the glass one. Yeah, I, if I can't, I don't, the dump cake is missing in action. We ate it, I know we did. I think you did dishes the next day, baby. Yeah. I think so. I just don't remember what happened. Why does it seem? It's only yesterday we came home from dropping off the kids. We're getting old. Oh my god! <laughs> Do you remember that we? Uh... I remember we ate it. I know. I, I remember. I brought I remember it. Remember eating? <laughs> You're awful. <laughs> the last thing I know is we ate. Just kidding. Okay. Do it in there. Yeah. So you can use a pie pan. You can use um, cast. You can use any size you want. I've done it with the round only because I like it a little bit thicker on the the crust that we eat. Um, and I take the help because someone's going to make it for me. I'm going to use it. So it's just pretty much like making a pie. Oh, shoot. My mom. Darn it. <laughs> tell my mom. Tell Chase. Tell Chase in there to... Um, Shoot my mom. Tell Chase in here? Yeah, tell Chase. Just tell Chase right up there. Chasey, call grandma, text grandma. <laughs> Darn it, that grandma. People, everybody wants me to text them. I've got nine million and one things I'm doing. There you go. So, you know what? I think I might roll it out just a little bit. All right. Only because I want it to go up a little higher. Honey, can we just chill? I'm going to go through with everybody watching. <laughs> you 
you think that I'm gonna press that hard? You never know. <laughs> <laughs> Joe, stop. <laughs> Joe. <laughs> All, right, here we go. All right. I stretch it out a little bit. I think that you don't need to. Normally, you can do it right into the the pie dish, but this because it's a deep, it's deeper. Did anybody see the picture that I posted, you guys? I posted our breakfast picture. It was so good. It was so good. It's okay, baby. Wherever it is. It's going to help you out. You don't need, I don't. All right, whatever. You do it yourself. You got it. Just trying to help everybody see, babe, while you're doing your thing. What is it doing? All right, this is a little frustrating. What you need? I don't need nothing. I'm the pie. Unless you're, uh, you're gonna climb into this pie pan. I'm an excellent pie pusher. All right, so filling is in. Or I'm sorry, the pie uh, crust is in. Get in there. Bailey's about Go. scared. Oh, that was her scare. Something must have fallen, baby. Move it in. All right, so in our pie, in our um, chicken pot pie, it's got potatoes, carrots, chicken, I forgot what I put in there, celery. I The only thing that I normally put in there is when my, my niece, when my daughter's home, we used to make two, I'd put one with peas for Joe and Destiny, and then, uh, me and I don't know if my son, now that I think of it, oh my god, I'm getting way old. I don't remember if my son ate peas or not. I think I was the only one that didn't eat peas. All right. And you guys, when you do your papas like this, if you don't use them all, like say you boil them, and you don't, I boil them so that way my pan, my pie doesn't have to stay longer than just the crust cooking. I do it. I I do the chicken before. I do all of my innards are going to be done, so that way when you bake it, it's just the crust baking. Okay. So if you don't use all of your potatoes, you can stick them right in the fridge, and you can use them the next day. Fry them. Put some oil in a pan. Put some eggs on them, and you're having potatoes and egg tacos. And I mean, you can do anything you want with potatoes. I. Do you want some of those? Um. Yeah, you can stick them with the other ones. All right. Mm -hmm. We did that homemade, you guys, all of us. We made this a homemade chicken, cream of chicken soup or a chicken pot pie filling. It's not even, I mean, you don't even have to call it chicken, cream of chicken soup. It's just a chicken, uh, chicken pot pie soup. Cream, chicken cream base. Yeah. Right. Yes. You are you busy, baby? No, whatever you need. Over here, just to, yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Show them what you're doing there. <laughs> I'm not. From now on, I'm gonna go live when you're in the room sleeping. Wait. Oh, wait. It gives me crazy when I don't take everything out of there. Okay, good. Okay, so you pour in the innards into your. Um, you pour the, I don't want, what the heck is that thing called? Chicken filling? The chicken pie filling. Okay. You pour that into your pie crust. I'm so used to, um, yeah, it's chicken pie filling. Then you spread it, make sure it's all even. This is what Joe could have been doing. Do you think I should have more chicken on it or do you think it's good enough? I have chicken set aside. Do you think I should put more? Um. Sure. You think so? I feel like. Yeah, why not? You guys, why not? We made it, right? Sprinkle more chicken on top. 
And I'm actually going to put some more salt and pepper for good measure. Um, maybe not so much salt, but definitely pepper. Um, how would I have ever found that? Not much? Oh, you could taste a lot of it? Really? Was that noticeable? Okay. Done? Yes? I gotta unravel this. Oh, look at Joe right there. You can see what the pie looks like. Oh, yeah. Ah. He's pointing at it. <laughs> Look at the picture. Yeah, it's live. Yeah, yeah. I'm just saying so we can see when it's out of out of focus. <laughs> oh yeah, it's very clear. All right. I'm going over the top. And I serve it with a spoon. I get like a spoon like this. Ooh, let me take you guys back a little bit. Once it comes out, I spoon it out like that. I don't uh cut it as a pie or nothing like that. It's it's just spooned out uh, dish. And then I, let me show you guys. Lift up, just bringing the top down over the rim. And then once it goes down, if you want it to have certain look, you can pinch it up on top. Is the thing on, baby? Yeah. Loving? <laughs> okay. I know it, it was my fault. I told you to hold up. I didn't want to eat the hot. It was already hot. Oh, yeah, we had other stuff. RV life. RV life. I am going to... Is it four? One... What do you need it on, honey? Uh, four. Four hundred? Yeah. You and I would do it at three fifty on your guys's stoves. Our oven is just um, just not as yeah, not as strong hot. or it doesn't yeah. seal or something. That's why Stephen Drew said something like, yeah, it just doesn't get as hot. I'm gonna do four big ones and then I'm gonna do tiny ones next to it, just so it has like a look to it. I'm all about the look. No, I'm just kidding. I'm not. Shoot, maybe I should be. Oh, what do you need? <laughs> what do we need to talk about on the stove? Uh, yep, I'm noisy. Oh God, how do you like your your stove when you bake in it? She said, uh, Joe, we need to talk to you about your stove in the RV. Oh Lord, look at that, guys. You're this gonna Joe in here, and I'm, it's not me. Take it in the. Stick it in. Is there a gel in there? Um. All right, I'm gonna stick it in the oven. Hey, zero. Hold on. Oh, hey, girl. Are we are we in the right position? <laughs> you put it in the oven. Yeah. Do you, I think I should wait for it to be a little hotter because it just went in? Or you yeah, just try? wait for it to warm up a little bit. All right. You want to mm -hmm. answer some questions? <laughs> Damn. Oh, there were beans there this time. Sorry, guys. Yes, I'm glad you love the landscape. Okay. You want to sit down? Oh, no. Okay. No. <laughs> we can answer right here. Bring the questions. All right. Here we go. Anybody questions that we can answer? Loving the landscape. Good. I'm glad you guys like the landscape. That was a, um, what was that called? It's a, a suggestion. I was going to say a, a advice, but it was a suggestion that you guys would probably appreciate it going sideways. Okay. I can't, I don't have any of my glasses, baby. Oh, you, okay. Ah, there's Joe. There. Isn't oh that the, God. Those are, that's the beginning, baby. Yep. So scroll up. I didn't oh. get to see any of them. So we don't know what All I'm right. going to say. I was reading the whole thing all the whole time. Hold on. Because that's how I am. Evening vibes. Yeah, you're going to. Uh, uh. Hey, Cecilia, sweetie. God, that's cool that new people are coming in. Thanks, you guys. Thanks, Liz, Flo, you guys. K-Bears, Mama, that's so awesome. 
I got my I got my regulars and I got some new ones. I'm so excited, you guys. So excited. Liz Lee? Yep. You know them? Mm, yep. You know them already? That's my that's one I was talking to the other day. Hmm. Shush. <laughs> K Bear's mama, your mom does your man doesn't want to, you know, and honestly, we started dating and Joe just likes being in the kitchen. I like him being in the kitchen because it relieves some of the pressure for me. Um, but other than that, if you guys have any suggestions to do, um uh what's that stuff called? Uh to appetizers and different different things that you guys have, even if you guys have a recipe you guys wanted to try, I'm gonna make fideo because Southern Charm wanted me to make fideo. So I'm going to make that. I was actually going to do that tonight. And then I started thinking, oh, you know what? I was going to do the Popeye. I had that stuff out. It's so touchy. Did you miss your button? Is it, is it what? Did you miss the button? You don't want to. Yeah. Look? Okay. All right. Um, if you guys have suggestions that you want me to, to uh, make, we do, um, we do wings. We do Southwestern egg rolls. We do uh, chicken chili. Joe makes a really, really good chicken chili. Um, what else, baby? Um, Jalapeno poppers. My apple pie. We do we buffalo apple chicken, pie. but I think everybody does but, a buffalo chicken dip. Oh, but we're all oh, for the Super Bowl. Yeah, for this week coming up. I think we're the rest of the week. If you guys wouldn't mind doing any, or smashing the thumbs up um, before you head out. There. <laughs> Good. <laughs> <laughs> um, what else were, were we talking about? My, oh, I, my phone. I think it's in the notes. Um, so we're going to do girls. jambalaya. Do you guys have a preference, jambalaya or gumbo? Gumbo. Joe makes them both really, really good. Um, ooh, Joe makes a good jerky, but that takes a long time for him to make and... Yeah, that's three days. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, I had a whole paper that I was doing it. Oh, you know what? Um, so we're gonna try different recipes that you guys wanted to see. What else do we do? But I mean, you guys are more than welcome if you guys have one. Like, who's um? I like. Does anybody like salads? Because I love making salads too. Um, salads are my like my jam. I mean, I don't make great ones, but I love <laughs> salads. <laughs> Let me rephrase it. I love salads. I love a cob salad. Um, what else were we going to make? You are going to do, we wanted to make a um, egg rolls, a wonton soup. Well, the jalapeno peppers that we make. Yep. And we're going to do wonton soup, but we make like the broth. But Joe makes homemade wontons because, I don't know, he has the hands uh, to do it. Um, but making homemade wontons. Uh, we did the enchiladas, want, uh, enchiladas, onion soup, tortillas, smothered pork chops, meatloaf, scallop. Oh, I was going to do the hamburger patty with mashed potatoes. Um, I made the frijoles a la chad, the hatch peppers, picadillo we still have to do. Pico de gallo we did, scalloped potatoes, wet burritos, empanadas. Oh, we wanted to do chimichangas. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Many uh, regular ones, yeah. Uh, if anybody knows what... Um, Shrimp cocktail, but it's like a ceviche. It's like the pico de gallo with avocado, cucumber, um, uh, right? Yeah. It's got the tomato sauce or yep. not sauce, but uh, like, what do they call it? Uh, we use not the one, what's the Mexican? We use zing zang, zing -zang. In, in it. Um, if anybody likes potato salad, I, I make my mom's potato salad. Um, I make a macaroni salad. I make homemade macaroni and cheese. I make like a cheese sauce and then I make it. So anyways, it we're gonna stick up. these into the the oven. I'll take a picture and I'm gonna post it. One of the our viewers, um, I didn't even think yeah. about it. I usually, I, I yeah. take a picture and then I, I don't take a picture and, and then I didn't even think about it. I'm gonna post it either later tonight so that way like I did with our breakfast Anymore we else? made the breakfast video and now I'm going to post, I posted the video of it. Or, I'm sorry, I posted the picture of what it looked like. Um, but I'm going to do it. It's right here. Oh, okay. I'm going to do that again. Live chat. Right there. Gotcha. Dislike. So I, I am going. To... <laughs> Great. I dislike this. I'm going to, um, I'm going to, um, what did I just say I was going to do? 
Oh, let me take a picture, you guys, so that way you can see what it turned out like. But give it a try. Let me know what you guys think. What's Put it in my the comments. Favorite dish, babe? Your favorite dish yeah, that you make. Um, you like Jesus, Joe? I like everything. Man. I know. It's I was so like, good. um, I was just asking him. We made um. That was from. Uh, we made like homemade taco. Uh, no, homemade XOXO. We made um homemade almost like a quesadilla, but it was like a taco, and then we put some like. Um, yeah, um, we put some, what did we do? Like the, it was like a quesadilla. I didn't close it. So I put some of the carne in it, yeah. like Mexican meat. Then I put the tortilla, the, yeah. on a, like a taco. Yeah. Your meat and then loaves. we had, Your meat loaves oh yeah, excellent. my meatloaf's really, really good too. Absolutely. Um, so I'm going to make, if you guys have a preference, put it in the comments comment on the picture tomorrow whatever if you guys think of it after you leave here but i will make sure to check the comments i love you guys thank you for coming in i'm sorry that um i'm a little scattering i get nervous that like it's not you visual it so you can see you so yeah yeah down. go ahead baby all right um, because i'm scared to carry it my hands give out like at weird at always the wrong time it's not right now no it's all right oh yeah, yeah hello <laughs> all right I'm gonna take a picture though for you guys so you guys can see it. There Thank you, all of my beautiful ladies. Thank you for all everybody set. that came in. And yes, Zero, we need your help. Uh, you guys have helped us so much. I'm like 100% new to this. Thank you for sharing. If all of you beautiful people can share, I would love it. I'm really desperately trying. Oh, Joe makes a homemade bean dip. Um, not a homemade bean dip, but like um, a Fritos. Frito-Lay, it's a, like a Frito-Lay knockoff for the bean dip. Yeah, Pretty good. yeah, yeah, yeah. But I mean, it's it's it tastes exactly like the Frito-Lay bean dip. You just buy a can of pinto beans, and then you put jalapenos, onion powder. Yep, a little sugar. And all you have to do is literally buy the uh, corn chips. It's so good. Um, okay, love you guys. Thank you guys so much. Love all my ladies. Um, thank you, Zero. You have given us great advice. I could not have done this. She's got a lot of subs. And aside from that, she's like trying to show us how to change the camera. And I had to call Dizzle at 1.30 in the morning and I felt horrible. But we finally figured it out and we were like, is it really going to work? Is it not working? So thank you all of my beautiful ladies for taking phone calls at 3 in the morning. Um, I love all of you guys. Thank and you, I'm, Sicilian uh, Princess. Sicilian sweetie. Oh, sweetie. Well, there's a whole bunch of well, Sicilians. Have a good night. You have a good night too. Thank you guys. We love you guys. We love you guys for giving us a chance. Have a great night. Good night, Marissa. Great, Marissa. Um.